Today, we're gonna check out the new episode for Tsukamichi Moonlit Fantasy. But before we do, if you enjoy the video, consider liking, commenting, maybe subscribing to the channel for more reactions. Let's get this video to just 300 likes. Like, let, let's see if we can do that. I'm sure that many of you are enjoying this series like I am enjoying it. And I think we could easily hit that goal and you can find the full length as well as exclusives over on Patreon. I don't watch this live on stream anymore, all right? Monday, I don't stream on Mondays anymore. So eh, all the times that I said, come by the live stream on Monday to watch along with us, I don't do that anymore because I need another day where I can just record a bunch of stuff. When I stream, I talk to chat so much because I really truly enjoy just engaging with the community. That unfortunately takes a lot of time out of my day. And so I have less time to record a bunch of stuff. And so three days a week streaming, that works much better for me. If I ever streamed more than three days a week, it probably wouldn't be anime reactions on stream. It would probably be the three anime reaction streams and then some nighttime streams where I play video games or something. If people are interested in that, I don't know if anyone is, but maybe one day people will be. And I'm kind of on a tangent right now. So with all that said, let's just check out, the, <laughs> let's check out the episode. Oh yeah, he's a teacher now, right? That's cool. Let's go, dude. My guy's a teacher. Why? Why is he so obsessed with the place? Is it specifically because of the food or because of the lady? What's going on there? Suspicious. Yeah, I'm gonna skip the OP. I'm gonna be honest with you. Yoink. <laughs> this is just. I was, uh, eh. Hot pots you ordered. What is that? Oh no, nah. I don't, I can't, no, nah, I can't do this. Mm -mm. Now that looks good. That's a soup, it's good. I'm sick, well, he is kind of, you know, or at least was dead. I wonder, is he, he's just, a, he is still a lich. He just looks like a normal person right now, but he still is. Or does that change? I don't remember season one enough to say for sure this or that, if that makes sense. Yeah, I can't really say for sure. This motherfucker's name is Bright? Is this, is this Bright motherfucker a bad guy? He's sussy, bro. The fact that he just walked over, oh, Hello, I am bright, but and he just wants to jump in here. It's kind of weird, right? It's or did we see him in the was he part of the 12 seconds later? I wish my brain worked at full capacity. Oh, great. See, I knew he was sussy the way he said that. I look forward to seeing what you can do. Mm. You keep that sussy shit away. Oh, it's that one lady. Oh, so she's the librarian. Nah, she's sussy, bro. Don't trust her. Oh, ah, I told you. I told you they were related. I knew it. I knew it. They looked the same. I knew they were the same. I knew they were related. I knew it. So she's not as sussy as I... Whoa. Damn! What the fuck, bro? What was that? How dare you? Wait, wait, what did he say when she said that? Oh, he just said sorry? Oh, no. Kind of seems like Mio. Oh! She paid the owner to study there. Wait, she did a good job, though. Yeah, I'm saying on what? What the fuck? Are any of these kids the asshole kid? Is that the asshole kids? If he's ugly, I'm going to go to it. Wow, that's fucked up. 
Want me to play the bad cop? Oh, this is the fuck. I hate that they. Oh, I hate the most fucking shit on his face, bro. Oh. Damn. I like it, though. That's facts, bro. If you can only use fire, for example, and you're going against something that is immune to the fire or has, you know, abilities that make it resistant to fire, you're fucked if you can't do something else. So that is very true. Master three elements. Damn. Ooh, this is cool. A little battle between them. Makoto versus Shiki. I don't even remember if that's his name. Makoto? Yeah, I feel like that's right. Oh! Damn! Damn! <laughs> I like that they're having, they're like battling at this intense level, probably more than any of these students have ever seen. They've never seen people battling at this level. It's, it's amazing to them. And all the while they're just having a conversation. It's, oh, wow. I can't believe you did that. <laughs> You're learning that. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's so cool. And here he goes with the classic. Oh my god. Damn, that's like a that's a massive rock. Water and fire at the same time. That is wild. So they they are literally they cannot they okay. Those were all magic spells that did not require incantation, which you could put. I guess you could put magic spells in in this world in in multiple tiers, and you know at a bottom most tier are ones where you are not doing an incantation, and is at the top. That's where you are doing the incantations, right? Something along those lines. I mean, I don't. I don't remember exactly what happened in season one, so maybe I'm wrong there, but I'm probably right. You know, incantation-less magic is not as strong as incantation-full magic. That's insane, dude. Let's go! We hooked one. He's hooked too. <laughs> He's not scared. He's scared out of his mind, bro. Oh, no. Nah, she's like, yeah, I'll, I'll come back. I'll be back for sure. Yeah, we sell this type of shit at our shop. You know, you can come by and get some if you want. Oh, yeah. She's she's definitely going to return. She'll She'll stick around. Okay, cool. Everybody's in. Him, maybe not. Those two guys back there, maybe not. And, and then some of the girls, I think she, this one girl could convince the others. But we've at least got four, for sure. Which is good. I think it's a good way to, you know. Sorcerer dressed in blue and red. Is it literally our boy? So he might be a paladin one day or something. His wife's on maternity leave from the school. How old is this? What the fuck? Okay. Wait, 
Abelia Hopeless? Is there like Hopeless. Okay, cool. Uh, oh, no, no. Hopeless. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely not Hopeless. Hopeless. Check out the ho plays. <laughs> no, Laurel, Co Laurel Commonwealth is very Japanese, I guess. He might have more of an appreciation for magic after this, you know? <laughs> what, are, what are the circumstances? Yeah, we're going to start. We're going to start now. I'm not going to be addressing that question. That way he can keep you from reaching that point. Whoa, he's making them fight him? To establish what their limits are? So these two are the last ones. <laughs> My willpower isn't recovering. <laughs> Aww. Nah, it's good. It's good having at least one tough teacher that really like pushes you. Oh no, bro. Why does every f it's so common. It's such a common thing. All of the fantasy, like, you know, the magic fantasy worlds in anime. At least the isekai. Whenever there's an isekai, right? So many of these things have a drug that amplifies your power. What happens as a result of the amplification? Bad things. And that's what this is. One of those amplification drugs. He is an academy instructor. Wow. Who would have thought? So he's the leader. Interesting. And there he is. That's the bright guy. Okay, see, I knew he was a sussy. I fucking knew it. I knew it. I didn't know why I knew it, but I knew it. It's probably something we already knew, like from earlier episodes. You know, it's not like a, a brand new thing to us. It's something we were already aware of that he was kind of sussy. So it's not like I'm saying that I recognize something that nobody knew. Like, I just had a feeling and, it, and I had a feeling for a reason. It's because we kind of already knew. Right. OK, cool. So moving on. Good episode of Tsukamichi. Our boy, Makoto, is now a teacher, and he is teaching in a very um, peculiar way. So he gets 10 students, and his first thought process is, I'm going to show them what really strong magic is. Fights with Shiki to, and dis puts on a display of what really strong magic is, right? Really strong sorcery and stuff. The next day, he's like, I want to see what your limits are. So come at me with everything you got. Beats the shit out of the class. Because the class has already gone from the 10 down to five because half of the class quit. So now that's what he's dealing with. You know, he's 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 gonna build up this group. And I think, I, I feel like they're going to become a good, like adventurer type of party together. They All five of them have their own thing. You've got your leader. He's a swordsman. You know, he has good control over how much mana he expends. You've got your support, the tall guy, the paladin kind of one that I mentioned, right? He seems like he is very, he's going to fit in that support role. You've got kind of like a ranger type of character. You know, the girl, she's going to use her mana and use bow, work from a, a distance, right? And then you've got one that's kind of, he's seen, they said he was quick-witted. He kind of is given off more of like an assassin rogue kind of vibe, right? Could be quick in, out. And then one that is the mage. That's the one that had the complex spells. And I feel like they all five fit their own roles and could work really well as a team together. So that's something that I, I hope happens. I hope that he kind of brings them up or builds them up 
rather to become a adventuring team together or whatever have you and maybe go on quests together work as a unit i think he's gonna build units like little small groups i think that he's capable of it at least the one kid that it was part of the the assholes that he sent fly in bullied him a little bit whatever you want to call it that were bullying the girl that kid now notice he's part of the school he's an instructor so uh-oh and Bright is definitely a bad guy, uh-oh. The librarian who's kind of sussy at the end of the last episode, the one that I said, is probably related to the girl that he saved. Surprise, surprise, is related to the girl that he saved. Yes, that is her sister. Not surprising at all. That's something that was very obvious, right? She seems kind of tough. Like, I don't know if I would say that she is gonna be more ally or enemy, because she was kind of sus at the end of last episode. This episode, I think she's just like cracking jokes. She establishes that she's the sister of the one girl. I feel like she might be okay. I don't think she's a bad guy. I think she she would more than likely side with us. I hope, fingers crossed. Good episode. What'd you guys think? Let me know down in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, consider liking, commenting, maybe subscribing to the channel for more reactions to this and other anime. Lots of isekai, fantasy, tons of stuff. You can find them on the channel. Just take a look, you know, literally just search on the channel. Maybe you're interested in Tensuda or Mushoku Tensei or a, a plethora of other series. They're all there, maybe. You know, a, a lot of them are there. Just, just take a look and you'll find even more over on Patreon. Till next time, make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace. <laughs>